The 1999 Connecticut State Quarter, released on October 12, was the fifth issue in the 50 State Quarter series and the final issue for 1999. Connecticut became the fifth state to ratify the United States Constitution on January 9, 1788. The Charter Oak was chosen as the symbol of the state. The tree story was deeply intertwined with the history of the state during its colonial period. Hey coin collectors! Welcome back to Coin Oz. In today's video we will be talking about 1999 Connecticut State Quarters. Are they valuable and rare in uncirculated grades? Hit that subscribe button below and let's dive in. This video is based on an article published by Coin Week. The most striking aspect of the reverse design is the intricate depiction of the tree's branches, which fan out over most of the face of the coin. Connecticut and 1788, the year the state ratified the Constitution, are found above the tree. Under the lowest branches of the oak on the left side but over a brief stretch of ground is the caption the charter oak, with the word the stacked upon the other two words in the phrase. At ground level to the right of the tree is a section of stonework wall. In the exerg beneath the ground and the tree is the date of issue, 1999, and the motto e pluribus unum. At a minimum, the value of every 1999 Connecticut state quarter starts at 25 cents, the stated value of the coin. The Philadelphia Mint struck 688,744,000 pieces for circulation, while the Denver Mint struck 657,880,000. As was the case with all of the state quarters, nearly all of these coins entered circulation within a few years of issue. Collector enthusiasm for the 50 state quarters program was white hot in 1999, and untold millions of examples of each issue were purchased at face value from issuing banks or purchased for a small premium in specially marked rolls and bags from the United States Mint. These saved coins will provide future collectors with the possibility to own mint state examples of the 1999 Connecticut State Quarter for centuries. Determining the numismatic value of an uncirculated 1999 Connecticut State Quarter will require an understanding between raw, ungraded, coins and certified, professionally graded, coins. A raw 1999 Connecticut State Quarter in mint state sells for a premium over the coin's 25 cents face value. A fair market value of a 1999 P or 1999 D Connecticut State Quarter in choice to gem uncirculated condition is between $1 and $3. Certified coins from Philadelphia and Mint State will have been assigned a grade between MS60 and MS69. Perfect MS70 circulation strike coins, while technically possible, are practically unheard of. The typical grade for a Mint State Connecticut State Quarter is between MS64 and MS67, according to data published by CAC. NGC, and PCGS. MS67 coins offer the best value for the set registry collector, with coins selling for as little as $40 each on sites like eBay. The price jumps to about $500 for examples in MS68. The record price paid at auction for a 1999 P Connecticut State Quarter was $4,362 in 2006. Another valuable specimen, this one from Denver, was showcased at Great Collections Auction in 2021 and fetched a sum of $1,040.62 with buyer's fee. This video is based on an article published by Coin Week. Thank you for watching this episode. If you found this information helpful, consider subscribing to our channel to receive daily coin-related content. God's willing, see you in the next episode.